Hi, welcome to Equator. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can calculate the percent in every other way with this Canon F715 calculator and also with every other calculator. So you will have for the percent, we will have three types of question. The first one would be, for example here, uh, what is the 18% of 650? The second question would be, 35 is what percent of 650 and the third way the percent would be asked is 110 is 18 percent of what value so we have three ways to do the percent so let's go with a very simple one and then so the first question would be let's say 18 percent of 650 so find 18 percent of 650 so we do 18 and then multiply by 650 and then shift and then this close parenthesis so that will give you the value so now actually the question you can write it like that as as to so you write six, 650 because it's 100 percent so write it 650 over 100 and then here the value we do know, write it with the same that actual value and the percentage at the denominator, so write 18% at the denominator. Once you do that, then 18, the one that is one piece, just write it like that. So we are doing cross multiplication. And then 18 multiplied by flip of that. So 650 over 100. So 18 times 650 divided by 100 will give you the answer. So the other question would be 117 is what percent of 650? So we know that in the previous example we did it, it it's 18 so but let's see how how we can find it. So we can do it the same way because 650 is 100 uh, percent just write it and then now this time 117 is known and the percent so make sure that you write the percent at the bottom then your question will be very simple do the cross multiplication so we do 117 by 100 divided by that or put 117 and then flip this value 100 and over 650 so now let's do it 117 times 100 divided by 650 and you get 18 percent so now let's say now it says 117 is 18% of what value? We know the answer is 650, but if you don't know it, 117 is 18% of what value? Same way, so because we have 100, uh, we, we, we don't know actual value, and that is 100%, 100, so you write it like that, and 117, and then look with a percent together. Now we do cross multiplication, so 100, and 100 multiplied by 117 divided by that so 100 and then the flip of the other side so 100 times 117 divided by 18 and we are getting 650 please thumb up the video thank you for watching